Hello all Blacks fans, if you don't want to miss any breaking news about your favorite team, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to date on the latest All Blacks updates. Good news for rugby fans in the Asia-Pacific region as New Zealand Rugby and Japan Rugby Football Union have signed a pioneering agreement to deepen the relationship between the two governing bodies. This move aims to grow the game of rugby and explore strategic and commercial opportunities. The Memorandum of Understanding deal will see the two national unions explore opportunities for the All Blacks, All Blacks 15 and Maori All Blacks to play Japan Rugby's Brave Blossoms and Japan 15 regularly from 2024 to 2027. The agreement will also explore opportunities for New Zealand Super Rugby teams to play Japan League One sides outside of core Super Rugby Pacific competition windows. In addition, the Black Ferns Sevens and All Black Sevens will also play the Japan Sevens outside of existing tournaments. There will also be talks about including some of Japan's top women's players to play in the Super Rugby Alpiki and Farah Palmer Cup competitions. NZR Chief Executive Mark Robinson and JRFU Chief Executive Kensuke Wabuchi expressed their excitement for the groundbreaking partnership, noting that the two governing bodies have a long-standing and strong history of collaboration and mutual respect on and off the field. This partnership will offer opportunities for teams across the spectrum to play more regular matches and explore how men's and women's competitions could work together in the longer term. With the shared love of rugby and the values that the game stands for, this partnership will bring new opportunities for growth and collaboration between New Zealand and Japan rugby. In your opinion, do you think this would be a good opportunity for the All Blacks? Leave your important opinion in the comments below. Stay tuned, as I'll be back with more news about your favorite team at any moment. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on the latest updates about the All Blacks.